transplant looks excellent. It's doing real well. My eyesight was getting very bad, so I went to my optometrist about a year and a half ago, and they found out that I had was developing cataracts. So I went and had the cataract surgery last year, and there was an improvement, but not any kind of improvement that I thought I should have. So I went back to my doctor then, and I, t and I told him about that, so he looked into it, and he said that he saw that I had corneal edema, which is water on the, on the eye. He has a condition called Fuchs endothelial corneal dystrophy. It's a condition where the cornea swells up over time, and it's related to a genetic predisposition. They were very, very blurry. It was like I was looking through dirty water, which I was looking through water because my eyes were holding it. Um, and they were getting dimmer and dimmer and, and more uh, vague. So it was just, I was going blind. As a cornea specialist, we see this frequently, and we've gone through the multiple iterations of trying to treat this. Years passed and decades passed, and we were able to actually start doing newer technology that started to replace just that layer of tissue, but we didn't have the technology to replace it for a one-to-one -one ratio, where we actually took out a thin piece of tissue and replace it with a thin piece of tissue. We finally got into that point, and that is DMEC. This DMEC or Decime Membrane Endothelial Keratoplasty is a, is a new procedure that was developed. And in doing that, it, they're basically doing a very delicate process of stripping the back layer cells, those sensitive, uh, those cells, the endothelial cells that are responsible for keeping the cornea clear. They have a membrane underneath those cells. It's called Decime's membrane. So the, the technician has to very carefully strip those, uh, that membrane with those cells gently across the entire surface of the cornea and then put it back into the preservation solution. So that's a very delicate stripping. Surgery was beautiful, it really was. You don't, they don't put you out, but they do numb the eye very much and you, you relax. They give you uh, medication to relax you. Uh, I think the surgery lasted about an hour and a half. But from the time the, the anesthetic wore off till now, I've never had another ounce of pain in the eyes. 100% better, 100% better. Uh, there's no comparison. It's a great technology. I think that it's one of the things that I've um, been waiting for, for it to really come into a, to its limelight. And it's really here now. And it's, it's probably one of the best things that we can do for our patients. It provides them the best vision possible. And it is a surgery that gives me a lot of comfort and joy knowing that at the end of the day, I have a patient that's going to be successfully be able to do a lot of the things that they want to do for the rest of their life.